Meanwhile, in Camden County, the search is on for a man who police say broke into a home, terrorized the residents, and then set the house on fire. Eyewitness News reporter Trang Doe is live in Collingswood, where neighbors are on alert this morning. Trang. Well, Janelle and Jim, this happened in broad daylight right in the middle of the afternoon in this very tightly packed residential neighborhood. Take a look. This is a look at the fire damaged home. You can see its windows all boarded up. Now, two people were rushed to the hospital as a result of their injuries from being attacked, and investigators are now trying to sort out just why this all happened. A call for a fire brought firefighters out to this home on the 200 block of Crestmont Terrace in Collingswood just before 2.30 Sunday afternoon. There were a lot of fire trucks, there were a lot of police cars, um, there was a lot of activity going on. Once the fire was out, investigators discovered the fire was intentionally set. Two people in the home told police a man broke in, attacked one person, and tied up the other. They say the man demanded money and before leaving, set the house on fire. Yeah, it's scary. I mean, you know, being a single female, I'm living alone, and to hear this news, it's, it's kind of shakes my nerves a little bit. Early Sunday evening, our cameras captured a police canine canvassing the property. Detectives remained on scene with flashlights until well after dark, removing bags of evidence from the house. Meanwhile, we are told the two victims are recovering. I'm hoping that they'd be okay. Yes, and I'm hoping that that house don't get destroyed, that it can be repaired. Now, it's not clear if the man was able to get away with anything. Meanwhile, the Camden County Prosecutor's Office and Collingswood Police are investigating this together. But for now, we're live from Collingswood, Camden County. I'm Trang Doe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Back to you guys. All right, Trang. Crazy story. Yeah, absolutely.